thanks to a beautiful go-ahead goal by Ruben Bover, his first goal of the year, the Cosmos were able to secure a 2-1 victory over the Tampa Bay Rowdies. They now sit atop the NASL standings just one point ahead of FC Edmonton, but this squad knows there's still a lot of work to be done. Ruben, so you guys are down, you're tied, and then you were able to score the equalizer. First goal of the season, How? what was it like to help your team out? No, it was an amazing feeling. Uh, it was so hard this month and a half. Injury was my first game back. You know, it was a big struggle the first 10 minutes because I didn't even warm up to come in, in the game. So it was great. It's an amazing feeling. It couldn't be any better. Now you guys are on top of the standings and you have your last game at home next week. What do you have to do to keep it going? No, we have to play like today, you know, be together, be compact and we have the quality in this team so things will happen for us. So we have to keep going. Walk us through, you're down one nothing, but your team's able, able to answer the call. Um, why do you think your team was able to be so resilient today? When the guys uh, are in the day in which everybody you know, works together, uh, things uh, happen for us. And um, I think at, at, at the moment uh, we could have been 1-0 for us. Right away they scored the goal, but I like the reaction of our team. The guys kept on believing, they kept on fighting, kept on going forward. And the game was uh, very difficult, but we matched up physically and that was, I think, the key factor for today. Carlos, what's it like to get the win in front of a home crowd on um, Portuguese Heritage Night? Yeah, obviously it's a, it's a huge game for us, huge three points, you have to win it, so, uh, you know, it was, a, it was a good game, it was a difficult game, they came out, uh, I think, strong, and, and obviously we were a little slow, but uh, it's huge to get in front of all the, the family, the friends, it's, it's a big night for us, and a big night for the club. And as you said, a crucial three points, you guys are now one point ahead of FC Edmonton in the standings, um, what do you guys have to do to keep it going? Keep winning games, uh, you got to keep winning at home, uh, obviously we need to do better on the road. You know, obviously a spring season, not many games left, so win your games at home, get points on the road, I think we'll be okay. With the victory, not only did the Cosmos pick up a crucial three points, but they remain undefeated at home. Their last home game will be on Saturday, May 28th. They'll be hosting Ryo OKC. If you want tickets, just log on to nycosmos.com.